Princess Leonor of Spain's royal profile rises as she comes of age. Welcome to Dream USA 24 of my channel. Princess Leonor of Spain will soon turn 18, bringing her into the public eye as the heir apparent and casting doubt on her future as an adult royal. Tuesday is her birthday. To celebrate, there will be a ceremonial ceremony in the Spanish Parliament when she will receive the Senate and Congress medals and vow allegiance to the Constitution. The Spanish royal family has made a number of previously unreleased images of the princess available in advance of the ceremony. One of them shows her with her father, King Felipe VI, who was still a prince at the time, and mother, Queen Letizia, on her first day of school. Another one features her holding the World Cup trophy that the Spanish men's football team had recently won in 2010. Some depict her with her younger sister, Sofia. To further emphasize the importance of her birthday, there will be a family get-together at the El Pardo Palace, which is located outside of Madrid, after a reception in the Royal Palace in Madrid. Following years of having her image carefully protected, the princess is finally becoming a highly public figure, as confirmed by the release of the images and a string of recent appearances in the run-up to her birthday. Carmen Ramirez de Canusa, a royal biographer, stated that Leonor will need her own narrative and that she will have to connect with her own digital generation. Everything has been going well leading up to the princess's arrival as a senior royal, even though the specifics of that story are still unclear. After completing her studies for the International Baccalaureate at UWC Atlantic, a residential institution located in the Vale of Glamorgan, Wales, she graduated in May. Her mentor commended her unwavering passion for learning, for understanding people, and exploring diverse perspectives, in addition to her sense of humor. Her fellow students whooped and clapped as she accepted her diploma. The princess's basic training at an army academy in Zaragoza, where she has started a three-year officer's degree, was then keenly observed by the Spanish media. Leona received a ceremonial sword and, like her peers, was observed participating in drill while wearing fatigues and a barret. On October 20, she presided over her own Princess of Asturias Awards, bringing her royal duties to the forefront. Thank you for subscribing to my channel. Meryl Streep, a Hollywood actress, and Haruki Murakami, a Japanese novelist, were among the people Leona decorated. She gave the attendees her word that I fully understand and am conscious of my duties and what my responsibilities entail. She lauded Streep, mentioning how the actor was able to do so throughout an impeccable career with freedom, courage, and sensitivity to the challenges of our time, giving up her own identity to take on her parts. The princess might have been describing the role she envisions for herself as the heir apparent, one that has undergone some trying times lately. For instance, in 2017, King Philip dared to speak out against Catalan separatists seeking to secede from Spain, marking an uncommon foray into politics. Juan Carlos, Leonor's grandpa, moved to Abu Dhabi in 2020 after abdicating six years earlier and becoming embroiled in financial issues. The scandals have subsided, but he has continued to reside there. However, Leonor plays a different, less serious function as a figure in Spain's celebrity orbit, one that goes beyond her institutional job. Given the curiosity in her increasing prominence, Leonor mania is already being discussed. Rumors surfaced earlier this year suggesting she was romantically involved with Pablo Martin Pez Gavira, also known as Gavi, a football player for Barcelona and Spain. Although such rumors proved to be untrue, they did demonstrate the desire in certain circles for the princess to appear in popular culture. The Bulgari earrings Leonor wore to the Princess of Asturias Awards presentation made headlines in Paris match. Journalist Jesus Reyes has even penned a book about Leonor, analyzing her style choices through the lens of her mother's influence. From her father, King Philip, she has inherited his commitment to the crown, his extremely polite manners, and his constant smile and pleasantness, Ray said. But Princess Leonor will probably discover that she is much more than just an institutional figure once she turns 18. 